सो लेट मी जस्ट एक्सप्लेन अबाउट ऑर्डिनो आई डी जस्ट सॉफ्टवेयर पार्ट एंड इफ यू जस्ट टाइप ऑर्डिनो आई डी यूल गेट दिस इन प्ले स्टोर सिंस आई हैव ऑलरेडी इंस्टॉल्ड इट लेट मी जस्ट ओपन एंड दिस इज हाउ इट लुक्स लाइक एट फर्स्ट सो यू हैव एडिटर पार्ट वेर यू गोन अ राइट प्रोग्राम एंड यू हैव दिस आउटपुट एंड डायग्नोस्टिक पार्ट लेट मी जस्ट एक्सप्लेन द पार्ट्स ओवर हियर सो यू हैव स्केच नेम ओवर हियर राइट नाउ यू आर using your present sketch name that's a default name you can change it and you have this button which is used to save and then compile upload then serial monitor and then the menu bar so just as an example let me just type blink sketch so let me declare int and the color changes int led pin number 13 then void set up pin mode 13 comma cpu d then i'm not going to type entire program i just wanted to show you that the colors going to change according to uh the color being set up in the software and uh, let me just explain you the parts over here we have sketch part where you can open some new sketch Yes, and then you have in sketch you can open the recent ones that you have used, and then also you can open some device whichever you have stored till now. I have used a lot, like I don't personally I don't have a laptop, so everything whatever already no projects I have been doing till now is through my phone itself. And then in sketch you have. Save, save as, and all close, delete examples. So as you start using Arduino, I prefer to go with examples. So there are a lot of it. If you see here, and again you have to go there. Then sensors, control, display, and then if you have installed few libraries, you have even get library examples. I have a lot of library installed already. and i'll even tell you how to install library so if you see mp6050 there are like a few other these green ones are comments and then below you have libraries included then program goes on and on and on so if you see navigation part here that doesn't uh, come with the free version you down below you can see that get premium and you need to purchase it and then you get access to all of it including the diagnostic part so let me just show you one of my sketch where you get navigator free open recent uh maybe this one no it doesn't okay fine so i have this program over here i'll just explain you the software part my ordinary is not yet connected to the device first i'll just compile it and you can see the compiling part being finished over here and if you just press that chessboard kind of box and just drag it you can see the compiled all the details over here and then once you connect your arduino using otg cable and the arduino cable to the arduino you can just press the upload button since i have not connected any arduino boards i can see the no no board a uh, message over there then other thing other main important thing is settings board type arduino every time you start with the project or you connect a arduino board remember to select the arduino that you are going to use right now and one disadvantage of this is that it doesn't support node mcu and after that you need to remember library manage libraries and these are the libraries which are already installed in your phone if you want to install new ones go to available connect your device to internet via wifi or data data and then you get all this all type and whichever type of library you want to use maybe you want to use some display search which display any thing maybe oled display 
you get these many OLED drivers display library soft here let me just uh, select this one press this download icon then it's gonna download and install in your phone and done now in the install part you get this library or oh, which was that OLED it's over here so now OLED display 96 cross 96 is over there now I can just go here sketch library examples and uh, if that has some example library examples okay it has a lot of them so just I can press it if I have that display connected to the Arduino why are these configurations you need uh, to connect them to so their pins I don't know how many pins are there just connect them and uh, upload this program and it will start working so this is about Arduino right there is one more app called Bellino Loader the speciality about this app is you can even program it via Bluetooth and I don't basically use this you just have to go to new file it starts like extracting tools and all open files examples so you have similar examples over here basics blink and then uh, serial monitor for which you have to pay and then compile and upload together and then you have all the important uh, brackets commas over at the bottom so preferably I prefer using Arduino droid and yeah thanks for watching